Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. <laughs> Is that good? Yes. 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 We are here at Woodlands Police Station. We are glad to report that Mr. Chilukia Tayali, uh, President of um, EEP, has um, been released on police bond. Is here with his lawyer. Um, I'll ask Honorable Brandon really to speak first, and then if there are any remarks by Mr. Tayari or his lawyer, they can also then make the remarks. Yes, we we did speak to the members of the public earlier, where we have expressed our concern regard, regarding the continued uh, and prolonged detention of Comrade Mr. Tayari. Uh, what we want to say uh, to the police is that uh, we are law.
law abiding citizens and comrades of Mali is a law abiding citizen of all of us. So when they uh, uh, want to carry out the investigation or indeed effect the arrest, we want them to do that within the confines of the law and also respecting uh, you know, the dignity and the rights that uh, citizens enjoy. Uh, this idea of wanting to keep uh, members in uh, for prolonged periods of time uh, is clearly uh, <coughs> not in line with the promised uh, adherence to the rule of law by the President of the Republic, President of the and the I want to make a call once again on the um, uh, Inspector General of Police that uh, he must um, uh, take the words of the Commander-in-Chief seriously when he said he would want an efficient uh, police service, a police service that um, we will give on the offenses within two hours of being arrested. That's what we want to see. He's been talking about this from the time that he was in opposition. He's been talking about this from the time that uh, you know, he assumed uh, the position of president of the Statue of So the police should not continue with that disrespect. Disrespecting uh, the president uh, when he has directed them uh, uh, clearly. And uh, it hopes the community that uh, going forward will have your day in court. You know, where you, uh, you, you present your defense and prove your innocence in, in, in the court of law. It's unfortunate that you have to be kept for so many days, he, he, you know, with a case that could have um, he, been dispensed with on the very first day that you have brought here. Thank you, thank you. Father Botadi, do you have anything to say? Well, uh, basically for me, I think uh, I just want to uh, say thank you very much uh, to my colleagues and friends, particularly from the Patriotic Front, because you are the people that have come in. I mean, you have helped me so much. But I want to, uh, you know, shower all my gratitudes on uh, this uh, gentleman, my lawyer, who has been with me. He has been running with me literally following me every step of the way when they were locking me up even when they locked me up he was outside even in the night yesterday i mean he has worked so well from makebi zulu um i'm really really grateful uh, for him i know he's a man of few few words he doesn't want to, to talk but uh, <laughs> i want to say thank you very much uh griffin for uh, for that as well relating to the issue at hand I will reserve my comment on my usual program. Let's meet at 20 hours. Tonight I'm not going to say, let me keep quiet. Tonight I will talk so that I can express myself. So 20 hours, I will give my sentiments, my feeling about uh, uh, this issue. Um, so thank you very much. As we spoke earlier, we stated that um, these are some of the laws that should not exist in a democracy. Seditious laws, criminal defamation, and these other laws that type of freedom of expression must not exist on our statutes, on our books as a democracy. Even this law requires for you parliamentarians to consider expunging them. And if there's a possibility, such laws, there should be a moratorium not to um, uh, implement them like we did on the death penalty because they take away the fundamental rights to free expression and, you know, freedom of thought, freedom of holding ideas, freedom to express yourself. So thank you for being with us. We are glad that Honorable Tayari, Comrade Tayari is out and uh, we wish you well and your family. Mm. Thank you very much. Let's meet at 20 hours. Where are you at the time? He's doing on that. Let's meet at my 20 hours. This is DJ Mutati exclusive. Alright, that's all for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you, peace. I gotta go.